Hello and welcome to technically episode three, but it's sort of episode four. Um, basically, what happened was um, so yeah. Basically, what happened was I did record. I'll let that know what I want to click on. So what happened earlier was I did record from the Rotherham game on which we won 5 0 versus QPR. Absolutely brilliant performance. Then we beat Sheffield Wednesday 5 2, won in the cup, and then lost 2 0 to Coventry for our second loss of the season. Which means. Oh, sorry. Which means we lost Joe Rondon. Uh, so, what we're going to do is. Hopefully. It lets me record this time and doesn't break. And we will do Huddersfield away. I think we're only going to do two games this video. Because I really want to play it. And also, I want to get a video out today. So, I don't want to let you guys out. Down. I know it's going to be super late on. I'm going to skip deadline day. I know it's going to be super late on. And I'm sorry that it's coming out so late. But, um, yeah, this is just sort of going to be a mix of the two. Um, I should probably make stats as well. So, I'm pretty sure Bamford is leading the top scorers race at the moment. Can't start. Oh no, it's Sinistera. Sinistera's tied with Bamford. So that's good. Uh, Ruta, he scored one goal. Um, Bamford scored twice to uh, pull ahead. Sinistera's just absolutely cooking. Uh, Perot scored twice in one game. So Perot's actually started to play well, to be fair. Uh, Dan James has been playing well. Um, and Purdue scored in the Carabao Cup. We brought back uh, Mark Rocker um, as one of the players that we got from winning. I haven't been too impressed with him so far, I must say. Uh, Jonto is up to playing time, but I'm going to hold on to him because I definitely want him to play. Uh, Glenn Kamara, yeah. Uh, Charlie Cresswell scored against UPR. That's really about it. Yeah, sorry about this. Whew. Jesus Christ, I'm tired. But yeah, sorry about that. Um, we're probably gonna do two games and then call it that. Cause yeah, this is probably the team I would want to play. So staring Cam, Cot, Jonto. Jonto's unhappy with the lack of playing time, so I'm gonna try. I'm going to play him for a half and then I'm going to bring him off because then he can play the next game because that next game's like three days later. So I'm going to, there's going to be a lot of rotation in this game, to be fair. A lot of substitutions of our better players. So we want to get this game done and just in the very first half. Fuck oh, no, I can't stop yawning. Yeah, we just want to get this game done and dusted within the first half, really. They're just throwing games at us, man. Ruta! Yes! That is wonderful. Absolutely wonderful from Jorginho Ruta. Back to his best. I think this is one of the only games he started since episode 2. So he's been. He's been there uh, quite. Tired. I think it's normally Perot and Bamford and then Sinistera and two duos. Oh! Perot! Oh, what a finish! He just... He just found... The, what is that? He just found the ball there from Somerville's shot. It was just deflected out to the right. Well, I don't think the keeper could just see Perot. It's a tough angle. But he, he's put it in. Oh no, no. 
That is not good. Oh my god, it's 2 2. Terrible moment. No, what are you doing, John Doe? We were 2 0 up. How? I licked him from the ball back. That means Von Don and Jed Spence now have to go back to Spurs. Brilliant. I need my Ramos questions. This is depressing. Right, so James Shackleton's going to have to play it right back. Until, um, fucking, we get Ramos questions. It's going to be fun, we got to play Sunderland. I doubt we're going to win that one. Went all down the hill when we took off Sinistera. What's Perot saying? I got my Perot man, Dolphin. My Dutch bloke. They got Joe Bellingham. I forgot about. I forgot about Joe Bellingham. I'll start that. To Dan James or some of them. That's one player. Dan. Fuck's sake, man, that loss has really pissed me off. We've just lost Rondon, so he shouldn't have even been there. He did twice with Rondon on the pitch. Maybe I should have waited for the substitution and taken him off. Because we didn't make, it, make another substitution for the rest of the match. Right. At home against Sunderland. I'm assuming it is at home because it's not the stage of the night to me. Just going to check. Yeah, it's not the stage of the night. It's most likely Ellen Road. Oh my word! Joel Perot! He's actually turning into a lead hero right now. Cesaro, what a ball! He takes one outside, chips the keeper. It's 1 0 lead. John Doe's off. He's done his man. The Sinistera turns his man. Sinistera! 2 0 within 10 minutes versus Sunderland. This could be an absolute battering. Oh, that is poor defensive. None of the defenders went in for it. We kick off. And uh, we're still 2 1. Oh, no, we've done. We've been absolutely violated by guess to him. Play across to the stero! Yeah! Luis Sinistera! Please tell me we're still recording. Yes, we are. Luis Sinistera! Oh no, it's free free! Oh, it's free free! Yes! Joel Perot! So you got some of you coming on, on that left. I'm not going to bring on Bamford. Put Perot into the hole there. Brian Aronson can come on like that. To the left 
left and then there's Charlie Cresswell on a left back. They're done for time, they're done. They're done, that's it, that's it. Time's up. Yes! Oh my god, Patrick Bamford didn't even fucking touch the ball, mate. He did Brendan Aronson, but who cares? Yes! Oh my god! Holy moly! Oh, we've won. That means player back from loan. And guess who's coming back? It's Rams Chris Stevenson. And he's gone up a rating. Na na, he's gone up a rating. Yay! My number 14. I mean, he's not the fastest bloke in the world, but he plays for Leeds United. He's a much more defensive right back, which is good. Him and Bob Cox, very good. Firpo. Could don't really have any attacking fullbacks really. He's got fullbacks that are good on the ball. Can push forward attack it. John Toe, yeah, his pace has gone up. Sinister, what a man. He's got five star skills. What a man. Who's got five star weak foot? What a man. What a team this is. I am so happy with this team. I reckon this might be where we call it today. Yeah, so we'll most likely be where we call it today is half eleven tonight. And we've already called for half an hour and I don't want this to cut out again. So I'm gonna call it here now. Um hopefully you all have a good day. Uh, post another video tomorrow hopefully thank you for watching apologies about the video this will be titled as number 3